This is what was waiting for Derek Avery when he showed up at the Jeffersonville Police Department Monday afternoon. The SWAT team, a canine unit, and numerous armed officers. I honestly believe that you can see, I believe it was a shocking uh, moment for him. Surprised and surrounded, Police Chief Kenny Cavanaugh says it only took minutes for the suspect to surrender. And it could have turned out a lot worse for both him and the department. He seemed to be really agitated, and he went right into, uh, you know, danger and harm. The whole situation started hours earlier at the Jeff Apartments. Avery lives here, and investigators say he called the police and made threats against them, specifically against an officer who handled a domestic disturbance call that Avery was involved in on August 9th. People Deeply live. disturbing. Fellow resident Cheryl Lanza found out what happened in an email from apartment management. For what we're paying for these luxury apartments, uh, there's a false sense of security. On Monday, a witness at the complex reported seeing Avery in the lobby with a woman believed to be his girlfriend. He was reportedly heavily armed, angry, and on the phone threatening to shoot someone. Just after 3.15, investigators say Avery drove to the police department, armed with two handguns and an AR-15-style rifle and wearing body armor. But Jeffersonville PD was ready. Officers took away his weapons and put him in handcuffs before he could act on any threats. They then went to his fourth-floor apartment to arrest his girlfriend, Megan Adams. Police say she came face to face with officers while trying to leave with more guns and ammunition. We do not want any violence. Um, what we want to achieve is safe outcomes. We want to keep the public safe. A dangerous police operation all around that ended safely. This is what we train for. In Jeffersonville, Madeline Carter, WLKY News.